These students, you guys, are in a very interesting part of the history of mankind. No other generation will be called upon so extremely and immediately to be part of so big and monumental a task. What you guys are particularly doing is way out in front of a lot of people. So you're leaders. His passion was kind of empowering me and was like making me feel like what the work that I was doing was validated. It's definitely inspiring and exciting just to know that someone so powerful wants to act on such a local level. My fellow Dickinson community, please help me welcome Mr. Mark Ruffalo. Hey. <laughs> you're this little college that's like up here. We face a world that is begging for us to readdress many of its systems. Where you see change that needs to happen, don't be afraid to fly in the face of it. Don't be afraid to stand up. We need people to just say, damn it, I've had enough. And that's when we're gonna see the change that we need. Mark Ruffalo was very inspiring. He taught us so much about his water defense website, and how much it connects with Alarm. Okay. We're gonna work with Alarm. We're gonna do a partnership with Alarm. Everyone here wants to have clean, fresh water when they turn on their tap. I don't care what your political beliefs are, or your ideology, or your race, or your religion. We all can agree that when we want to turn our water, we want clean water. So I started water defense, but since that time, I realized that we needed real, we needed data. I brought in this incredible guy, Scott Smith, who's here right now, who invented this testing methodology that's cheap, it's easy to deploy, and we can, citizens can use it. We're just here to arm you with the best available technology to know what's in the water to fix things. And one day, we're all gonna put this together, and we're gonna say, you know what, this, that's it. The system isn't working for us anymore, and we have to do something to change it, and it's gonna happen from the bottom up because it never happens from the top down. It doesn't happen. Everything takes time, but you can begin to affect some kind of change. You fight for what you love.